Hello, I'm Simon Buck, and welcome to my Business Tips series. So today we're going to talk about KPIs, or Key Performance Indicators. Now, they really are the true numbers of business. If we understand the KPIs, they are the numbers that are driving the success of our business. So the first question I get asked is, what are the things that I need to measure? Well, for different businesses, they can be different things. But I suppose what you're trying to understand is, what are the numbers that truly influence whether the business is successful or not? So for instance, around the sales process, there might be things like the number of leads that we get into a business. There might be things around the conversion rate that we receive, how long customers stay with us, what the average spend might be. If you're in manufacturing, there might be about the performance of machinery. There might be about the efficiency. There might be about the output. In HR, there might be about how long your teams stay with you, how many recruitment places you have to fill, how long they take to fill, what the attrition rate might be. So across all areas of the business, KPIs can be put into place. But if you think about um, the dashboard of your car, for instance, really what we're trying to do is we're trying to create a dashboard for your business. Now, there might be five things that you look at when you drive from A to B. They might be the speedo, they might be whether you've got enough fuel, they might be the warning lights you have a quick look at, the navigation system to understand if you're on the right route. And there's a couple of warning lights that if they were to come on, you'd probably take some notice. So similarly, we're looking for the same sort of thing. When everything's green, when we've got the right speed, where we've got the right petrol, we're headed in the right direction, then we just keep motoring on. However, if one of those starts to dip, we need to know about it before it becomes critical. So the key performance indicators are the very, very top line numbers. Now, if anything goes wrong, we stick the diagnostic in, we perhaps pull over, we lift the bonnet, we look at all the component parts that sit underneath. And there might be thousands of parts within the working engine, but we're really focused on five. So what are the top killer key performance indicators? And then break down by department, what are the three, four, five numbers that would give you a fantastic feel about whether your business is in a great place? So start with the top line, think about the rest of the business, and if ultimately you can have a dashboard where every single part of the business has got its three, four, five key numbers, when they're all green, you're in a fantastic place to just hit your goals and ambitions. Thanks very much. Thank you.